Hey guys, what's up? It's Marty here, and I'm kind of filming a different type of video. I know I've been vlogging a lot lately. Well, today I thought, I mean, he hit his one year. My, my Bentley did. So I figured what I would do here is, I remember, I mentioned, gosh, I don't even know how long ago. It was obviously it was over a year ago when I got my Urbini Omni 3-in-1 stroller slash car seat combo. I said that I would do a, a review once I've used it. So, it's been a year now. I don't use it any longer. So, I kind of guess I would figure I'm going to review it slash go into the car seat I use now and kind of review that one. I've been using that one for about two months now. This is kind of two reviews in one. Um... <laughs> the Urbini, I'm sorry, let me make sure this is high enough so you can actually see me. Um, the Urbini Omni 3-in-1, I think that's what it's called, the travel system, the stroller and the car seat. Stroller, love it, would recommend buying the stroller. Um, it was very convenient when he was a baby that the stroller hooked right, in, or the, the car seat hooked right into the stroller, but I know the one I had, had was kind of inexpensive, and I know that a 1-Up... Like, if you don't mind spending a little bit more money, I know they have a city select or something that does along the same concept. Um, yeah, like I said, I love my stroller. It works great. The insert that I use for my stroller works great. The straps are long enough. It's amazing. Um, I like that it kind of still lays down. I mean, he's one, but at the same time, he, when he wants to sleep, he wants to sleep. And if he's in a sleep, I'm glad that it kind of lays down into a bed like stroller it's not quite like the other ones where the feet still dangle so I guess that's just kind of comfort type thing I mean I wouldn't go out of my way just for that purpose um I would not recommend the car seat at all um it is the worst car seat I've ever seen in my life the straps are shorter than no end my son could only use it until he was like four month, four or five months old then we used my nephew's older one which was an Eddie Bauer car seat which was amazing straps were long it was had a lot of room and my son isn't just bigger um, I mean I guess unless you had like a really small child he was good for his age he's supposed to be where he's at he's n never been no more than 21 pounds and if if it's four months or five months, I'm trying to think back, he was probably only like 16, 17 pounds, somewhere in that area. He's just recently started leveling out now that he's moving around a lot more, um, and he's not just eating formula and stuff. I just, I don't recommend it. Don't ever buy it. Don't ever get it. Um, it's, it's horrible. The straps are, it, it, the, it's inconvenient. The... I know some have a little cushion on the carrier bar that you carry it around and that's a lot more comfortable than what we had. Um, the visor really did not keep sun out of his eyes. Um, let me, I'm just trying to think of anything that was wrong with it. Um, but other than that, I mean I guess other than those two important things, um, it was all a okay. Um, I don't know where I'm going with this. I don't know what else I'm trying to say here. Um, so yeah, I don't rec recommend it, especially for the price. I mean, it was, I want to say I spent like $200 on that when I could have spent $200 on a better car seat and stroller combo still too. And I could have even spent less and gotten a better one. So I just don't recommend it. I know there were a lot of negative reviews first time moms you kind of buy what you think is cool and then you learn what's can what's actually convenient and usable and what's not <laughs> so big thumbs down for the um, Omni 3-in-1 not the stroller but the car seat and I know they have the Urbini that car seat just for sale don't ever get the car seat if you can just get the stroller it's a really good stroller I think it has the wheels work great you know it's only the one type of wheel it works great on all terrain like we've used it over gravel and stuff and it hasn't been too difficult um, I would say to purchase a little thing to hook from side to side to put like your drink and stuff in. It doesn't come with one, which is kind of inconvenient, but my sister-in-law had an extra one, gave it to us, and it like strapped to the sides, and it lays across there. Um, it has plenty of room down below. Um, I have a diaper bag that can hook onto it, so I don't have any issues with that. If you needed to, I know they have like a mommy hook, and it's it's fairly inexpensive that you could get for more um, hanging space or if you're shopping or anything with it. Um, yeah, so basically 
don't get the don't get the car seat at all. Just okay, and I thought I'd throw in here a little tidbit here for you. The I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Um, so we now have a convertible car seat for him, have had him in a convertible car seat for two or so months. I want to say, oh, I got to think about this. I think I got it back in March. So maybe three, wait, March, April, April, May, May, June, June, July. You know what? Probably about four months. We've had him in it for probably about four months, actually. Um, love it. I use the, okay, so when I went to go get... Um, a convertible car seat and my thought I had no budget I was like you know what whatever's the best whatever's the safest whatever's gonna last me the longest for what I'm buying I'm going to get well I was between the Chico next fit which I know a lot of YouTube moms I've seen them use and have really good reviews and then it was between the Graco forever um, I chose the Graco forever it was cheaper by a good I got it on a deal but I know it was cheaper by a good like 50 dollars I got mine for like 160 something and I know the next foot was over 200 but I don't know if it's regularly that big of a difference but it was a $50 difference it works just as well the headrest kind of comes up to the side which I really like um, there's a button that literally you just adjust the headrest and it goes up and it goes down it's the easiest thing ever um, it's the easiest thing to install I do have those cinch things in my car um, I don't know what they're called, so don't ask me on that. I can't think of it off the top of my head, but you just plug it in and tighten it up. Um, we still have him rear-facing. I want him rear-facing past two at least. Um, until he's two, like, you're rear-facing. I don't want anyone forward-facing him, but if he happens to get in someone else's car who's watching him or whatever and they forward-face him after two, I'm not going to make too big of a deal about it. Um, I just know the safety of rear-facing is just, it's just best to have him rear face. Um, it, it's really comfortable has a ton of cushion I think if you guys I know some people choose to use convertible car seats earlier than what even I did and when it's more convenient for them um, like he was born right before winter so we didn't start using I didn't get a convertible car seat till it started warming up a little because it was just easier to carry him in a um, little carrier with you know your little car seat your infant car seat it was easier to carry him around in that with just a blanket and a blanket on him and over him and keep him warm versus actually having to get him out so we did that um until it started to get warmer out so anyway i was going over i don't know where that where i went off that tangent there <laughs> but i used the great goal forever the four-in-one turns into a booster seat and everything. I recommend it. I really love it. The straps are great. Um, it's really easy to get in there. It's um, super easy. There's two cup holders, which is kind of nice for when he gets a little bit older. Um, I got a gray and black one, so it's perfect, you know, for any gender, to be honest with you. So it has really neutral color. Um, it's very, yeah, like I said, it's very cushiony. It's very easy to um, move the the part that goes over his chest it's really easy to move that up and down and I know for some people it doesn't matter but I have had some where it's like so hard to yank it back up on the baby so it's really easy to move it down while I'm buckling it all together so it's not too close and then move it right back up onto his chest um straps are easy to pull out um so yeah it's I really recommend that car seat I mean I've only had it for four months so don't get me wrong I don't know what it's like in the booster seat form don't know how to put it in a booster seat form but um, I really like it for where it's been and it has like seven or nine one of the different ways you can have it lay so you can have it sitting all the way up you can have it laying all the way back and obviously different ways in between so that's really convenient because we have him lay back a little bit right now we don't have him sit him we don't have him sitting straight up yet um, I don't really know when I'm gonna switch it over I don't yeah he, he's kind of comfortable the way he is he hasn't we haven't noticed any like have him complaining at all or anything in it um, and he just you just when he sits in it it's the funniest thing I need to see if I can catch it on a vlog sometime he his his right leg just stays there his left leg comes up and out and it's always his left leg is like on the door every time never fails it's the cutest thing ever um, but I'm gonna go it's a long enough video, long enough talking for me, for you guys. You probably don't want to hear me just talk about random stuff. Um, we have this one-year checkup, so I am going... I want to vlog it. If I do not vlog it, 
sorry, it's just really hard to vlog things because um, his dad doesn't do the vlogging, I do, and I'm the one that holds him at these appointments when he gets his shots. So it's kind of hard to do that while holding down a one-year-old. <laughs> so I'm going to get, we have his appointment. If anything, I'll let you know how it goes. Um, I feel so bad. He hasn't had to have shots since he was six months old because the nine-month checkup, he didn't have them. And he just had to have a 